Tony Abbott has caused his biggest stir yet in the climate change debate with a provocative speech in London. He told a group of climate sceptics that global warming is doing more good than harm, adding that fewer people die in heat waves than in cold snaps. Giving a global warming controversy a cold shoulder. Is climate change actually good? <laughs> this is a, uh, a great day. After Tony Abbott told climate sceptics in London, climate change itself is probably doing good, or at least more good than harm. Speaking to a group led by former UK Chancellor Nigel Lawson, a leading climate sceptic. It clearly is good for the planet. Highly critical of the science. This is madness, but it's not merely madness, it is also wicked. Mr Abbott likened those pushing for climate action to primitive people who once killed goats to appease the volcano gods, adding, I observed that the so-called settled science of climate change was absolute crap, saying the answer to Australia's energy crisis was not more renewable energy, but that there must be a government-built coal-fired power station. Mr Abbott was speaking at the same venue where Mr Turnbull gave him a whack earlier this year. The PM today couldn't get away quickly enough. Well done. Tony Abbott's still calling the shots. Turnbull's just simply too weak to take him on. Mr Abbott did have some faint praise though, backing the government's decision not to proceed with a clean energy target. And I can reveal the government hopes to have its alternative plan through Cabinet and the party room in the next sitting fortnight beginning next week. Ministers tell me it will have a heavy emphasis on base load security and retail pricing and be as much about reliable energy as renewable. Mark Riley, 7 News.